Hey there, this is Alan Osler coming to you live from sunny South Florida, um, Palm Beach area. It's awesome here. Hey, but today what I want to chat with you about is not getting caught up in all the hype that's out there in the real estate market news. You hear a lot of things in the news about the market's going to collapse, um, it's going to crash, don't buy now. It's all over the social media, and I know you guys are following it, but there's one thing that they're not talking about out there is the fact that when you're not doing your own research, not doing your own homework, you are relying on somebody else to give you the information that you need for your deal, but your deal has nothing to do with the information they're giving you. Now, what do I mean by that? What I mean is that the deal that you're looking at is local specific. Now you've heard the saying, location, location, location. Now that's real estate because if you're comparing a property just one block away that is bigger or in a different community, it's gonna throw off the value by hundreds of thousands of dollars, okay? So don't sit there and compare this market news that you're hearing to your deal because it's talking about all kinds of factors. When you start to unpeel the onion, the layer of, of the onion, you'll see that there's all kinds of factors like, is the market cyclical that they're talking about? Is it a linear market? Is this real estate crash in commercial or is it in residential? Um, is it in affordable housing? Is it in luxury housing? What are they talking about? They're just compiling it all into one specific data point and they're just fear mongering selling it to you on YouTube and you're giving up control to their information by not doing your own research. Stop giving up control. Go out there, find your own information, find your own properties and start making money. Now th there's a couple things that I have wrong with these people that are out there teaching that the market's going to collapse and it's specifically that they're trying to sell you something that would have you give up control to them so that they can sell it to you and maybe even manage your real estate portfolio for you, get a real estate commission. Um, there's all kinds of different ways that they're trying to make money on you and you're just giving up this control and a lot of these people are incompetent and don't even own a property themselves. So stop listening to these people that don't know what the heck they're doing, don't own property, haven't done this themselves and have no real life experience. Just avoid what they're talking about. That's not the right way to do business, okay? You never want to give up control. That's like the major commandment here. Don't give up control. And if you do give up control because you believe in somebody has some higher power than you do, what that always ends up in is a heartache because you'll end up paying not only their incompetency fee, but you'll pay a management fee to the guy that set the deal up. So, don't get all caught up in all this hype that's out there. Go out there, find specific deals. What I'm focusing on right now is new construction and I'm focusing on as close as possible to the very affordable range because the housing shortage is in affordable housing, new housing, and it's location specific. If you find these things, then you're gonna have a great deal. And I like the new construction because the builders don't have an attachment to the property the same way that resellers of existing inventory do. The resellers, these single family homes, they have a fixed mortgage rate on the property in the low 3% and they have 28 years left on the mortgage and they have no incentive to sell the property to you at a discount. They don't have to get it off their books. They don't have to refinance. They can just sit there there's no pressure making them want to sell. Now, new construction, a builder, they have to get it off their books. They don't have an attachment to the property. And what's so good about this for you is you can take advantage of this by getting seller credits, discounts, and as mortgage rates start to come down, you can refinance the property. So all this, what this means is this, go out, do your own homework, don't take anybody's word for it, and stop letting the fear mongers convince you that the market's collapsing. The real stats are over the last year, the real estate market has gone up by 5%. Go check it yourself. That's not what this is about. I'm not saying it's not going to come down next year. It could very well come down next year, but do your deal due diligence on deals this year, local specific, 
Don't let somebody else sell you on it. Make sure you are comfortable with it. Make sure your financing is the way that you want it. Take control of your life. And if there's anything I can do to help you, reach out to me, let me know. I've got strategies that can help you with your credit optimization, business planning, tax planning, which will maximize your resources. Stop relying on people like your CPA to do all the lifting for you. I know what you're doing there too. You're just throwing a pile of shit at them and you're expecting them to figure it all out on April 15th. That's giving up control. Take control of your financial situation. Know how all this stuff works. And if you need any assistance, have any questions with it, reach out to me, we'll get you on track. Hey, if you like what you're hearing, follow me, watch more for more videos. Let's be in touch. My name is Alan Osler with Asperity Pro and make it a great day.